Meanwhile, new at five, a busy part of Walker County near Smith Lake is getting a permanent sheriff's substation aiming to help tackle crime. CBS 42's Michael Clark explains tonight why the sheriff says they need to spread out their resources. While most of the deputies are stationed in the Walker County seat of Jasper, the sheriff has a lot of ground to cover here. The new Curry substation will be the third to open this year, and businesses there say it's needed. Inside Curry Discount Pharmacy, a supply of medications that can improve health, but also be a bullseye for criminals. Pharmacies are often a target of robberies, and I know several pharmacists who have been held at gunpoint, gunpoint and robbed. Pharmacist Beth Richardson is excited about her future neighbor. The Walker County Sheriff's Office is setting up shop near some of the other businesses in the Curry community near Smith Lake. You know, we're here until after dark, especially in the winter time, and there's usually three or four of us up here. I'm just thankful to know that someone will be close at all times if we need them. Curry will be the third substation to open in Walker County this year as deputies try to spread resources out to everyone in the large county. If the east side deputy has a substation on the east side, he doesn't have to come to Jasper for everything. He can just use that substation. That means filing a report, holding a suspect for the jail in Jasper, or simply taking a break can all be done from the substation, saving the deputy and neighbors a trip to the county seat. It keeps the officers serving the community that's often busy with lake traffic and home to plenty of vacation property. There are a lot of people that live in that area on the north side, um, and there are a lot of businesses up there, and there are a lot of opportunities for our deputies to be seen in that community. And businesses in that community can't wait for the new neighbors to move in. I just think having the presence is going to deter some people and then I'll know that they're close if something does happen. Now right now the sheriff's office says you can expect to see at least two deputies per shift once that substation in Curry opens in a few weeks. In Walker County tonight, Michael Clark, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.